show you how to love again. I'ma show you how, show you how, show you how to love again. I'ma show you how, show you how, show you how to love again. I'm Paris and today we're going to share with you 10 organizational hacks that are perfect if you want to get your room organized and especially since it's that whole spring time of the year and you're all up in that spring cleaning vibes we know we are so we think that these hacks will be perfect for you so we decided to just stop and get our act together stop cluttering our lives with unnecessary things and these hacks have helped us do that so I'm pretty sure they will help you get on that whole organization lifestyle so as always before we get into this video don't forget to follow us on Instagram Twitter and snapchat so you'll be the first to know when anything fun and exciting happens. And of course, if you do enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up and try to get it to 1500 likes <laughs> to see more videos like this with Roxy and me. Also, if you have not subscribed to this channel already, girl, what are you waiting for? Go ahead and hit that subscribe button somewhere on the screen so that you won't miss a thing. So with that being said, let's get straight into this video. First up, we'll be making a washi tape organizer because we know how crazy it can get if you have a lot of washi tape and can't find the ones you want or don't have anywhere to store them at all. All you need is an embroidery hoop and yes, it's as easy as that. An embroidery hoop is really inexpensive and there are many different sizes. All you have to do is unscrew it, slide your washi tapes onto it and screw it back when it's all filled up. Basically, the way that a hoop is designed, you can see all the colors at once so you won't have to dig through to find the one you're looking for. It's really such an easy way to store your washi and you can even hang it up in your room as a decor piece. Hack number two is an easy way to display and store your sunglasses. Paris and I have our sunglasses all over the place and it's so hard to find the ones that we want. So all we did was take a hanger and slip our sunnies onto them. And it makes such a cute display that's again really inexpensive. And of course the hanger is something you probably have at home already so get organizing. It gives your room that boutique vibe which we think is so chic and you'll never have to go hunting for sunnies again. The next hack is to display your hats on the wall while organizing them at the same time. All you need are command strips that can stick easily to your wall and be removed without damaging it. Just slide your hats onto them in any pattern or design you want and that's it. For us, we chose a straight line right above our sunglasses rack. It's a great way to brighten a blank wall without having to do too much. The next hack is to create a hanger extender to save closet space and pair your favorite pieces together. All you need is a soda tab and you can just slip it onto one hanger like this and slip the other hanger through. You can actually make an entire chain of hangers connected by soda tabs, especially if you want to store really small pieces like crop tops or matching sets. Instead of using 4 to 5 hangers that will bulk up your entire closet, you can just use one and trust us, your closet will thank you. Hack number 5 is to organize your cords using binder clips. So we've seen this DIY a lot on Pinterest but when we actually tried it, it did not account for desks that are too big to fit binder clips. So we came up with the solution of using a canvas as a tray on the desk and slipped the binder clips onto them really easily like this. Another problem that this pin had was it didn't account for plugs that were really small and that would slip through easily. So a simple solution to this was to secure them with the top side of the binder clips like this. So when you're ready to use it, all you need to do is pull the plug and charge your device. This is really great because it prevents you from digging through a tangled mess of cords every time you want to charge your devices and trust me, that can be pretty annoying. <laughs> Hack number 6 is to repurpose candle jars for storage. You know those pretty ones you get from Bath & Body Works? A really easy way to get rid of wax is to just place the candle into a pot of boiling water until the wax starts to melt like this and eventually you can pour out your wax until you have an empty candle jar. Then you can just clean it and use it for any kind of storage you like. We really love putting our lippies and nail polishes in them and on the upside they make really cute vanity display pieces as well. The next tip is to paint your keys so you won't have to fumble and try a million times before you can actually open the door. You can just use nail polish and paint the tops of them in a solid color or you can do pretty patterns like polka dots, flowers or stripes. This is especially great if you have a large bunch of keys to work with. 
Hack number 8 is to make a close spin memo line, which is one of our fave ideas from this video. All you need to do is paint your clothes pins different colors and once they're dry, you can take a marker that you like and we chose gold of course and write in the letter for the days of the week or you can even write in the entire word. We hung twine over a desk and attached the clothes pins onto the line like this. You can put sticky notes with your to-do list or events that you have for that specific day. Or you can just attach cute quotes for some daily inspiration. This was so bright and colorful and we just loved how simple and easy it was to do. Uh, 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 oh. The next hack is to make a little notepad holder for your clipboard. I have this gold glittery clipboard that I made in another DIY video and all we did was hot glue a little box onto it and it was such a cute way to give the clipboard a little bit of extra storage. You can use any box you like. This one is actually a perfume box and all we did was add some sticky notepads and pens to it. So now you definitely won't have to go running all over searching for pens anymore and you will have easy access to all of your notepads. The last hack is a DIY phone charging station. So we all hate when our phones need to charge and they're just knocking about on the floor. So for this you'll need an old shampoo or body wash bottle and you should try to use a thin one that will be easy to cut through. You're gonna cut a pocket like what we're doing and cut off the entire front of the bottle like this. So once you have the front part of the bottle cut off, take a nail file and sand down the edges because they can be a little sharp. Next you want to make a hole big enough to fit your charger, cut it out with your exacto knife and don't forget to sand it if you need to. Spray paint it a color that you like and let it dry for a few hours. And you can even decorate it by using some cute washi tape. Now all you do is plug it into your wall and put your phone to fit into the little pocket nicely like this. And there you go, you have an easy phone charging station. So that was the end of our 10 organizational hacks video. We really hope that you enjoyed it. And a lot of these tips were so easy and you only have to use stuff that you probably have at home already. So we hope that that motivates you to just get going. So don't forget to give it a huge thumbs up for more videos like these and if it gave you any inspiration. And don't forget to join our little family. Just hit that subscribe button and we will welcome you with open arms. Okay, you guys really agree yeah. me <laughs> But thank you so much for watching and we will see you in our next video. <laughs> Bye! Mm -hmm. It's a revolution.